This video, we are going to talk about The Your Eternity Season 2, Episode 5. Why are you? Why are you cheating? Hindi pa natin na review na katik. But anyway, keep on watching. It's, um, quite an episode of affirmations, right? But, uh, one thing's for sure is the first order of business, which is the thumbnail. Proposes to Fushi. <laughs> um, I, I don't think some of you uh, may find this amusing, but certainly I find this scene amusing. And, and um, it's also the final scene of this episode. Kahaku knows for a fact that Fushi wasn't even born a female. And, well, kaya lang siya. Uh, uh, na parate is because of the insistence of Bond. <laughs> it makes a great thumbnail, right? It makes a great thumbnail. So, yeah. it's gonna make you think uh, probably uh, at least a thousand times in, yeah, if if God was in his right mind. <laughs> yeah. Flat out. So, with that in mind, let's get to the nitty gritty of this episode. Face! The pacing was moderate. Dahil, uh, they had to, they had to um, skip a time, skip one part of the timeline. Because uh, if they're going to stick to the same, uh, to the same, what's it called this, uh, setting, eh, well, mahana mga borong viewer. Or if they're going to devote a full episode just for that, uh, just for that particular adventure. Yeah, the Your Eternity had to move on. But do I have complaints, guys? No. Nope. You gotta understand, guys. The Your Eternity is... Uh, it's based on the adventures of an immortal, si Fushi. And if you're going to... Uh, if you're gonna give it a dragging pacing, we're in one city, isang episode, one city, isang episode, then... I truly believe that you gotta show the audience that uh, it's a matter of it's an urgent matter for Fushi and the rest of these uh, and the rest of the lead characters to, to absolutely exterminate the knockers. And it, it's also because of the pacing that you're gonna realize that okay, so may mga motivations para mga to, meron din sila mga hidden agenda. Kung babagalan yung hindi nyo maapreciate, kung babagalan ng ng, uh, ng studio drive ito, hindi natin ma-appreciate na. So, I got no complaints as to the pacing of this episode. Swak lang. Flow naman! First gear shift here was, well, probably the most obvious, Fushi resurrects Anna. Obviously, it's a gear shift, folks. Because, you now see that Bot is absolutely working hard to, uh, to keep Fushi in uh, in his uh, to to keep Fushi in line for to his uh, to his own personal interests. Uh, some friend you are, okay? some friend Bond is. Hindi niya sabi, hindi niya sabi agad kay Fushi. Second gear shift was when uh, the beholder finally shows himself to Bond. This is another no-brainer with your ship. Bakit? But the last time the Beholder showed himself to a person other than Fushi is Pioran. In the finale of Season 1 pa. Nung ginawa, niyang, uh, nung ginawa rin niyang immortal si Pioran. If there's anything this gear ship will tell you, is this. Bond now knows his limits when it comes to his interests. Okay? Kasi... Alam na, alam na niya ngayon na meron ganitong nilalang na nagpapantay kay Fushi. One, uh, one big mistake and it's probably all over for him. Final gear shift was when, yung, the final scene. Kahaku proposes to Fushi. Right? It's, for me, it's hilarious. But it's also a great setup for the next episode. Kasi, Wow! 
big big time na tearship to kasi ha <laughs> Sino sa mga ako? <laughs> obvious na obvious. Ang ganda ng setup nito for the next episode. So these three gear shifts that I saw guys. Ne, dito ni. Kung ito lang tatlong gear shifts ito papanoorin niyo. You might not completely understand the whole episode. So, yeah. Lengthen your attention spans for a bit and watch the whole episode. Plot wise. Excuse me. Isa lang ako masasabi ko sa sa plot ng episode na to. Malinis ang plot, guys. Bakit? Oh! Kung akala nyo iron out ang plot na to, no, you're badly mistaken. Hindi po akit in-express ng, uh, ng studio ang kwento ng episode na to. Hindi ibig sabihin na, uh, well, iron out plot. No! It's still following the main continuity of the episode. Uh, in ano lang, finast track lang. It's a clean plot, guys. And, why would you wish for a well iron out plot? Hindi sira ang momento ng episode na to. You tell me. So, pace, flow, and plot. <laughs> they all came together for the sense. The Eternity has done it again. So, the Eternity Season 2, Episode 5. To Nanza! I am. Uh, I'm at least 60% sure na umaangal kayo sa rating ko. Well, I'll give you a little explanation of it. Magaling plot. Alright? Put it in your brains that the main protag of this anime is an immortal. It would be absolutely boring as fuck if Studio Drive will concentrate the storyline of a single episode in a single city or in a single place. I don't... Um, I don't see that being successful. So... And... Oh! The gear shifts, yeah, they are gear shifts. Dito talaga sa tatlong ito, kumambyo ang story ng episode na to. If, if they had boring gear shifts, eh, eh, eh. I mean, I might have given it a lower rating, but no. Like I said just a while ago, to your authority has done it again. So, let's just wait for the next episode to, yeah, if, if we can review it, and watch the next review while you're at it. So again, to your eternity, season two, episode five. Two.